Alright, so me and Tommy D are in a post office right now. Um, I'm not sure why I'm whispering right now. I kind of feel like I'm in a library. We're applying for a P.O. box. Hopefully we get it. That way we can start doing it. Hopefully we get it. It's like a, we're applying for a job. No, seriously. They're going to run your credit. It's like, it's like getting a car. I'll let you know if we get it. Come on, Tom. Let's get this. What did you do here? To get approved. You need your driver's license. You need your car insurance. Your car registration. Because that's easy. Happened. We didn't get approved? No, I need my car registration. Dude, I told you it's like getting a car. What if you don't own a car? Tip number two right here. Come on, Tommy. We got it. We got approved. We got the P.O. box. 4002. Right here, right here. Moment of truth. Well, there's a little prize in there for us already. <laughs> for real? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I can you see that. We just got the P.O. box, and apparently now we're gonna go get a, a couple's massage. massage. It's one of them treat yourself days, son. Mm -hmm. I love hanging out with Dom because he he knows how to treat himself. Like I never have like a nice day to myself, or like I get a massage, like a little spa day. Or he's about that lifestyle though. Like every time it's like, hey dude, come on, let's go get a nice Italian dinner. Or we, you know, get a cannoli. Dom, you're the man. Mm. <laughs> Make sure to send us some stuff to our P.O. box. We just opened it up. Everything's ready to go. But I'm going to put it right here. So if you want to send something, if you want Dom and I to see it, then just uh, yeah. go ahead and do that. We got to go treat ourselves some more. So. What's on the menu? Right? I don't know, babe. Let's just do it. Have you ever made anything that you've seen on the Food Network? I feel like nobody I does. I haven't, no. This is, like, it's, it's there for a reason. Like, now that you I watch think these. About it. Right? I was thinking about this last night. I was like, I watched so much Food Network and all these like cooking yeah. shows, and I've never tried to cook anything. You watch it and you're like, oh, yeah, that looks really good. Maybe. Maybe well, one day I'll get around to that, or you know what I mean? Like, so right. So, uh, someday, you know, maybe I'll try it. Nobody ever actually cooks the stuff that's uh -huh. on Food Network. I think because the hard part is like you would have to sit there and write everything down. Yeah. And duplicate it. I mean, I think on the website they have like the. Who wants to go through all that trouble? You know what I'm saying? Like, God forbid, we gotta go on the internet to like get it. I was watching uh, yesterday. It came on. It was Gordon Ramsay's Perfect Scrambled Eggs, and breakfast food is my favorite. I absolutely love breakfast food, and I'm like. Well shit, this is the perfect scrambled egg. This is something I should probably try. Saying it's the perfect scrambled egg is a lot to, you know, that's a huge statement. That's a that's a big claim. You better have some Whoa. bomb scrambled eggs because I'm not gonna lie, mine are pretty fire, Gordon Ramsay. Let's put let's put you in front of him and have you say that. <laughs> oh my god, he would rip me apart. So we're gonna grab the stuff to go try out these perfect scrambled eggs. Yeah, let's do this. <laughs> scrambled eggs, here we come! Kim, you're already messing up, baby. We gotta do it in the pot. It's totally different. It's the oh, perfect geez. scrambled egg. We're not doing it our way anymore. I never cooked eggs. <laughs> <in the pot. laughs> right? I don't get it. But you know what, Gordon Ramsay, if he does it. It's gotta be good. Eggs. Crack the eggs with here. one hand. Don't, don't, Gordon don't, Ramsay don't. did it. He did it so casually too, he was just like... Nice, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna put like some sirens like... Ur, 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 on top of that to make me seem cooler. Let's not do that again, because I feel like I got lucky on that one. Cold eggs. Cold, gotta be cold. Dude, there's a lot to it. <laughs> now we need three knobs of butter. How big's a knob? Is that a knob? No, a little more. Oh. That's a knob of butter. <laughs> Seems like a lot of butter, huh? <laughs> yeah. Jesus. <laughs> Maybe less, yeah. We'll do it. Oop, skinny little knob right here. He does it so easily. Oh, wait, we gotta get the bread going. Cam brought out the big daddy knife. I had to get the good bread knife. Damn, I don't get that in the normal kitchen. He has his, like, serious knives, like, in his room locked away. Dude, bread knives usually go for, like, a good one. Maybe $35. Mm hmm Guess how much this one was. What is this, made of valerian steel? This thing's insane. That's like 110. For a bread knife. <laughs> yeah. Nah. That's bread right That's there. That's nice. Look at the marble on this puppy. Gently slide your bread into the toaster. 10 minutes on toast mode. And just let it toast. And just let it toast. You don't want to rush it. Just let it toast. Gently stir. And now when you do these eggs, you want to you wanna do it 30 seconds on and 30 seconds off. And then 30 seconds off. And then 30 seconds Let it cool. Back and on. then back on. Because you don't want to overcook it. You want them to soften. Cream, very smooth. 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Let it cool. As you're doing that, I'm, I'm scraping the bottom. <laughs> Scraping the bottom. <laughs> and then and, and back, back on. on. <laughs> so over the top. And then now, back on. You, you don't want to season your eggs right now because the it, it'll turn gray. Damn, you got a good memory. <laughs> I didn't know that. I always used to season my scrambled eggs Dude, right yeah, before man. I would like put it in. And that's why my shit's come out gray. <laughs> oh, oh, back off, back off, back off. These better be some damn good eggs. It's a lot of work just to scramble. Oh, they're coming together now. Off. Yes. Off, back off. 
Zane, we're cooking Gordon Ramsay eggs. Maybe I know I smelt it. It comes out shit. It's gonna be disgusting. <laughs> I know it is. No, dude, you have oh. to scrape the bottom. Scrape, 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 scrape it off. Oh shit. <laughs> Let me... Sorry, Gordon. Here. Gordon, Gordon, hurry, hurry, Cameron. See the consistency so far? They're wow. coming out. Make sure to not overcook it. Now, Don't overcook it, Cameron. Cold eggs. <laughs> yeah, we did that. Straight in. Yep. <laughs> Take your butter. Three small knobs of butter. Every time I stir, I'm cleaning the bottom of the pan. He had that oh. puppy ripping. This is why he's an Iron Chef, and we're YouTube chefs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's it. Now we season, right? This is why we need to mise en place. We don't even have we don't even have the pepper open. Hold on, guys. Hang on, right there. Ready? Season lightly, season lightly, lightly. <laughs> okay. Kosher salt. All right, that's enough. Hold on, hold on. A pinch. Nice. Oh, creme, creme fresh. Wait, we have to stop the cooking. Um, stop the cooking. Stop the cooking, Cameron. Get a spoon. Get a spoon. Spoon. We can't even make scrambled eggs, Cameron. Teaspoon. Creme fresh. And that stops in the there. cooking. Stops the cooking. Fluffier. This is the hardest batch of scrambled eggs Dude. I've ever made. He made it look so easy. <laughs> okay, here it goes. And plating. Look how fluffy that they is. They do look really fluffy though. They look nice. I didn't know what it was until this video. Creme fresh. This is probably disgusting. Oh me. That's a big Oh my god. <laughs> I think I'm allergic to it, Cameron. <laughs> That's one ingredient we're not gonna be using again. I have to do it on the bias. On the bias? Yeah. What does that mean? Like on an angle. Oh, okay. Why are they going everywhere but where I want them? That's not bad. On the bias, right there. Boom, the perfect egg scramble toast. Well, let's give this a go. That's some crispity ass toast, dude. Uh, chef, there's a hair on the plate. <laughs> <laughs> we would be done. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> it's real, real good. Wow. That's some. All right. That's some bomb ass scrambled eggs right there. I'll vouch for it and say that's the yeah. perfect scrambled egg. Zane, you want to try it? Zane. Zane. Zane! Yeah. Do you want to try it? How long did it take you to make this? It's not long, it was just... And it tastes? Maybe the second time around it'd be easier. But that was... There's something about it. It's good, it's just nice. Alright. I give that two thumbs up. Alright. Yeah, that's definitely uh, award winning. One of the best scrambled eggs I've ever had. Yeah. And it's another beautiful morning. Another baby. beautiful, hot, mm -mm. humid morning. It sure is. Just like Florida. It's bad. We should just go back to Florida because this shit's not going to go anywhere. Oh my God. Speaking of going back to Florida, bitch, I leave tonight for Florida. I'll be there in about probably four, five, six, Ooh, seven days. Oh shit. I am so excited to go back. Ooh. I spit on you, my. Okay, that's Zayn always spits when he talks. And like, but but like you'll make it so obvious. Like I'll say I, something and he'll do this, and it just makes me feel so guilty and no, bad. And baby, I just stop no, talking. it's because we'll be sitting there and we'll be like super close, like face to face, and he'll just spit and it hits me in the like the eye or like right in my mouth. And I'm just like. But you know how many people spit on my face when they talk to me, and I just pretend they didn't do it because that's just like the respectful thing to do. And then when they turn or they're not looking anymore, you're just like. Okay. Oh my, but no. But you do it right there. That the shit is like nasty. Because <laughs> it catches me off guard. Just whack. And the face you make, you're so pissed. You're just like, I'm like, oh shit, did I spit on you? Yeah, it's fine. I'm like, I don't mean to make you feel bad. It's just, I'll just do it to you and just see how it feels. I just want to say thank you to everybody who's been like on the hunt trying to find Big Red like the past like three months. I appreciate it so much. Thank you. It just sucks the situation that happened where they found it too late. I wasn't able to get it back from my insurance company and then the whole auction thing. And you guys trying to find the auction like you guys are absolutely amazing. I did my research into it seeing like how I would go about getting it back. Turns out it's just going to be like a loss on my behalf. So basically it would it would just not make sense to get it back because it would be a salvage like rebuilt title if I did get it back because it was stolen even though nothing really happened happen to it it's just it's it's not worth it to to buy it back you, you'll so, be wasting money if even if you try to go hunt it like hunt it down yeah. and get it back you'll end up spending way too much time and too much money on uh, a truck that's not gonna be worth title. anything yeah. um, so it does suck but it, it is what it is um, so I'm going home to Florida to buy a car hang out spend some time with my family been like a little homesick so I'm super excited to get back there and then also my mom is gonna fly back 
out here with me and she's deathly afraid of flying so I'm super nervous for her but she's gonna come out and stay for a few days she got onto a flight and then had to get off right when they were getting ready to take off she's like I can't do it I can't do it she had like this panic attack and like got off and then had to get like another flight like, everybody that's watched Final Destination definitely did not like yeah. your mom getting off that plane because they probably thought she's had a premonition oh my god for real right <laughs> I that's would really like funny. that if somebody like freaked out and got off a plane like they knew they had to get off I would be so uncomfortable I need to get off too I believe in shit like that like I yeah that. no for real though and I hate flying so so I need to start packing and getting ready because I leave tonight okay baby my little coffee beans I'm gonna see y'all when I'm in Florida so you'll see both of us when you're in Florida right well you're gonna be there later so you're gonna see me in Florida first but then you're gonna see both of us together <laughs> bro you shot that shit I'm like Zane, I'm like this I'm like I'm like I was waiting for it to get silent I'm waiting for you to stop talking I'm just like Hey, you there? Are you okay? Oh, you nasty! Hey, egg, sorry! Alright, guys, so that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Shout out to the week goes to Princess Mana. Thank you so much for your support. Damn, you're pretty good at that. Yeah, I'm really good at that. <clears throat> baby, come on! I was yeah, just seeing if you had another egg. Yeah, I'm wearing shorts now. Oh, come on, baby! Stop! Go get it! Get the whole thingy!